Hiya, so today it's cardio abs and I'm going to do it with a HIIT formula. So it's 60 seconds of work, 30 seconds of active recovery in between each. Two lots of each move. There's not many moves as such, it's just I'm going to do it in a slightly different way. But anyway, straight in. So while I'm talking, take five minutes to warm up. Do that as always. So again, during every 30 seconds, I'll show you what the next move is. There you go. So first of all, while you're warming up, while you're marching, I want your arms in front and you're going to do a big figure of eight in front. Yep. Fast. Well, as fast as you can. So we're going to get ready. And it's four, three, two, one. Let's go. We're dipping down at the same time. We've got our chest up. We're dipping those knees. Big, big, big figure eight on its side. Breathe, keep your chest up. Anytime you need to stop and drink your water or just march in place, that's entirely up to you. Keep those arms straight. I want a big dip round. Do your best to get it to the side of your leg. You'll feel it in your legs as well. Try and keep that stomach tense. And keep those arms tensed as well. Feel it in your arms. Big, big circle. Beautiful, just shake it out. We do that again. Kick your legs out, roll your shoulders, whatever you need to do as long as you're still moving. We'll start that again very soon. Get ready. Clasp those hands together. Feet quite wide. Here we go. Big, 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 big figure eight on its side. All the way round. straight ahead I'm not looking down I'm using control I'm focusing on that movement and I'm focusing on tensing everything so remember it's a figure eight you're crossing in the middle Beautiful. I'm going to have a quick sip. Do that whenever you need to. Sip, don't gulp. Your next thing, single elbow to knee. Don't care, don't matter what side you start on. Arms on your hands on your temples or up above, and you're just doing one elbow to knee. You're keeping your feet wide. Reaching that elbow up. I mean down, sorry, and that knee up. So one leg only, one side. Step that foot back out wide each time. Really reach it in, try and get that elbow to the outside of that knee. Obviously, how far you reach, that's up to you. I'm just saying that's your target. That's what you're reaching towards. Keep breathing, really reach it in. Ugh. You can slow it down anytime you need to. Beautiful. Kick those legs out. We're going to do the same side, mess you up, 
And then we're gonna do two of the other side. Get ready. Like I said, you can slow it down to speed it up to you, as always. I know I say it over and over, but it's really important that you do everything at your level, your pace. As long as you're challenging yourself. You're obviously working your legs as well and your arms. Just holding them up is work. might find yourself slowing down that's okay as long as it's as fast as you can in that moment beautiful kick out obviously we're going to do the other side now like I said there's not many moves we do single side other single side then double side on some of them Try to keep it pretty basic. So get ready, we're doing the other leg. Let's go. Bring that knee up and round. And obviously that opposite way for your elbow. Step back out, breathe. Keep that chest high. <laughs> Ill balanced then. You look at your whole body. I always try and do that even though I'm working on your abs, particularly everything else is working as well. Side step side to side, kick your feet out, march, whatever you need to do. Sip your water if you need it, when you need it. Same leg again. Got 10 seconds. Really reach that elbow as far around as you can. Keep those arms up. Control that foot going down, don't just sort of land, if that makes sense. It's up and down. You're focusing on every, every bit of movement. Doing it all with focus and control. So you've got loads of stuff going on today. You've got hit, you've got abs, and you've got cardio. Eh? How good am I, eh? Oh, kick your legs out. Oh. Next thing, single side heel taps. So you're bringing your heel up and you're reaching in. One leg. your feet quite wide let's go bring that knee up oh, bring that knee pretty well bring that knee up yeah and bring that heel tap it 
try and get your foot back where it started you're going to really feel this in your legs as well I hope because I can I'm on, that, I'm on that loose floorboard again, aren't I? Maybe all these floorboards are loose just because I'm doing this. Maybe it's not the floorboards at all. Beautiful. We do the other side. Blimey. This one's uh, really trashing me a little bit. Get ready, we do the other side. Bring that heel up, step it back out, bring it in. Come on, keep going. Ooh. <sighs> We're gonna alternate. We're gonna do both sides, one side at once. <sighs> move your legs. However you feel, you need to move them. Let's get ready. Because I'm alternating sides, my feet are a little wider than before. It gives me a little bit more stability. So I can add a bit more range of movement. Beautiful. I'm going to keep moving. Sip your water if you need it. Could do it a bit again, both sides alternating. dipping in there's almost a bit of a crunch going on in our stomach keep those feet as wide as you can really bring it in keep those arms pretty high I don't mean up I just mean out
seem to be speaking a lot less than usual today. I wonder why that is. I've said it before, but I never work anybody else harder than I'd work myself. I've got to have a twist, I've got to have a march, whatever. Oh. So, we're going to combine the elbow to knee, heel tap. So it's one side, other side, one side, other side. Yeah. If you get confused, if you get messed up, it doesn't matter, just get back into it as soon as you're able. So, elbow to knee, elbow to knee, heel tap, heel tap, elbow, elbow, heel, heel. I've slowed it down a bit. Now I can really feel that now in my abs. Like I said, if you get confused, doesn't matter. Just get back into it. Beautiful. What we got next? We've got one side. We've got our hands clasped and we're going to go up and down, up. I'm going up on my toe on this side, I've got my arms straight and I'm, going to, I'm reaching up, up over my shoulder, just one side. So get ready. Bring your hands sort of by your hip, other hip as you come back down. Remember you're going up on that toe, those arms are straight. You're reaching all the way up and twisting round. Lost my balance then. Really feel that twist. Beautiful. Just shake your arms out. Step, side step, march. Kick your legs out, doesn't matter. You're doing the same side again. Roll your shoulders. Get ready. Chest up, shoulders back and down. Feet quite wide. And up we go. I'm not pushing it up there and then letting those hands drop. It's control up and down. Those arms are straight, remember. I am most definitely breathing. Remember, we're reaching back round to tap that hip. Your legs are straight as well. Shake those arms out. Obviously, we're going to go twice on the other side. Whew. Get ready. 
ready. Other direction, obviously. Going up onto that other toe. Really get it as high up and like you're trying to throw something up behind, up over your ear. Up over your shoulder, behind your ear. But higher, of course. See, I'm going quite quickly, but to keep hold of that focus and to make sure I'm doing it right, I can't go too fast. Working those obliques, those muscles at the side there. Wonderful. Roll your shoulders. Keep moving gently. One more time on that side. Again, use some force to get those arms up there. to go up onto that toe. Beautiful. Next thing we're going to do, you've got your arms straight and in front this time. And you're going to pivot to the side and come back in the middle. Pivot and back. Just one way. You go, Don't go all the way around and hurt yourself. Stop. Just before you think you could just go a little bit further, stop there. Because that's the control and then bring it back. Start straight ahead. Slight dip in your knees. And go around. Keep those arms pretty much parallel to the floor. Follow your hands with your eyes. Come all the way forward at the finish of that little movement. More work for those obliques. Try and keep your shoulders down. Don't have them up into your ears. My stomach's making funny noises. Oh, beautiful. Shake your arms out. Release them. We're going in the other direction. And stay moving during your 30 seconds. Get ready, arms in front, slight dip with your legs and round, round and back. Doing a bit of a Charlie's Angels thing. Yeah, 
Charlie's Angels. In reality, I'd flap my hands, cry and run away. Okay, feel in your arms. Oh, so keep them straight, keep them tensed. Beautiful. We're going to do one side at once, so the whole way around. Get ready. All the way around. Full control. Keep a solid base with those legs. Make sure you're holding steady. Everything is tense. Shake your arms out. So now we're going to combine. You fell over. We're going to go up, up, round, round, up, up, round, round. You're welcome. Speed is entirely up to you. Until you get the technique in your head, don't try and go too fast. So. Going up, down, up, down, round, round, up, up, round, round. Hitting your abs in all over the shop at the minute. Be careful of your balance. I seem to be facing a slightly different direction now. I seem to be pivoting around slightly. It's right. Oh, nearly fell over. You know what I'm like with balance. Beautiful. Next, I look at my time. Next is just one elbow to the same side, knee. We're nearly done, it's your last minute coming up. Just throwing in something different at the end. So, Keep your feet quite wide, you're bringing your knee up and your elbow down. And dip into the side. Keep going, we're nearly done. Just one of these. Beautiful. 
shake your arms out, have a gentle twist. And on your hip, reach over, bring it back, reach over, bring it back. I'm just, again, I'm just going to do a quick, quick, quick cool down stretch. You do as many as you need. And look, my belly is making a right noise. Circle those hips. You take as long as you need to get that heart rate back down to normal. Whew. Just have a bit of a kick out. Roll your shoulders, take as long as you need, honestly. Right, well done, Fitness by Susie. I hope you've enjoyed it. Cardio, abs, hit. Loads going on there. You're welcome. And I'll see you again tomorrow. Bye-bye for now.